hey y'all welcome back to my channel so today's video for our workout series i'm basically if y'all can't tell by the title i'm going to be showing y'all the best home workouts for a crazy glute pump you can do these well i'm doing them with weights but you can do them with or without weights you can use resistant bands usually the best things to do use resistant bands if you don't have weights at home hope y'all like this video make sure you guys like comment subscribe turn the post notification bell so that whenever i post a video you guys are notified and yeah, stay tuned for more workout videos. I don't really have a number of um, sets I do for RDLs. I kind of just go to failure. If you want to see the best pump when working out, you always want to push till failure. Because if you don't, I mean, what are you working out for? And that's what I do. I used to do reps and stuff, but yeah. I'm always pushing until you feel a burn in your glutes or wherever you're trying to make your body bigger, wherever you're trying to get a pump, you always want to feel a burn. So next thing I'm doing, we are going to do um, Bulgarian split squats. The best way to do it is to sit on the bench, put your foot out um, straight, put your heel, put heel toe down and stand up and that should give you guys the form you need. Um, you, also, you, you guys will see in a second, but I should give you guys the form you need to fill the burn and get a crazy pump. All right, y'all, so now that I finished um, Bulgarian split squats and RDLs, I'm going to go in with the resistant band. I'm gonna go in with the resistant band. Since we don't have a hip abductor machine, um, I'm going to basically be doing hip, I'm basically gonna be doing hip abductors with the resistant band. So yeah, y'all. Um, and then two, I usually do um, hip thrusts, but I don't have assistance with me right now. Um, so I can do it by myself at the uh, gym because it's a Smith machine, uh, but this is just like a free bar. Um, so I'm not going to be doing hip thrusts. So I will see y'all uh, after this one. So now that I just finished that, my hips are on fire. Um, so usually when I finish all of my workouts and do my, um, yeah, when I finish all my leg workouts, I do a 30 minute, usually on the Stairmaster, but we don't have that here. So I'm going to be using the treadmill for about 30 minutes, 15, 30 minutes. Let's see how I'm feeling, but my legs are dead. Mind y'all, like I said, I don't do sets. I just do until I burn, until I the burn till failure um but i do do until failure about three two three times so that's how y'all gonna get the best pump but this is the pump right now before me getting on the treadmill so i'm gonna show all right y'all so yeah that's the pump before i get on the treadmill um but we're about to do about 15 30 minutes on the treadmill yeah, I will see y'all when I get back.
All right, y'all, so as you just seen, I finished my workout on the treadmill. So yeah, I usually do about um, 15, 20 minutes on a treadmill after a good workout, just so you get your cardio in. <clears throat> um, but yeah, that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope y'all like the video. Make sure y'all comment down below what other videos y'all wanna see from me. And yeah, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next video.